Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today I'm off to the Cotswolds for three days, two nights. I'm staying at the Ligon Arms Hotel, which is like a hotel and spa. Um, it takes about two hours to get there. I'm going with a couple of friends and we're basically eating English country food, going to Dalesford Farm Harvest Festival tomorrow, and then Sunday, plan the plan is, might change depending on weather because currently it's sunny, very windy, but classic English weather will catch up with us for sure. The plan on Sunday is that we are gonna go up to Stratford upon Avon, maybe go see Shakespeare's house. It's a very quintessential English weekend. So I'm already sat in Chaffet. Especially like five minutes away from my house and I've got about two hour drive. Um, it's fine. We've got the tunes. The sun is shining and it's fine. I haven't forgotten anything. Anyone else ever get that weird feeling where they've always forgotten something and then they arrive and remember just at the moment you need it. Now, oh, well, nothing I can do now. We've arrived at the Ligon slash Ligon slash Ligon. No idea how to pronounce this thing, but it's really big and really sweet. We're all checked into our room and now we're going down for a pre-dinner drink because it's 10 past five. This place has always been a hotel since at least the 1300s. It's terrifying, definitely haunted. We've arrived at Dalesford Farm and already gone to the masterclass of pasta and we missed it. Too busy in the spa this morning and loads of breakfast, but there is beekeepers, there's like sheep, there's loads of things. I haven't even walked around yet. So um, I will show you, I'll try and film everything and show you. a gin and tonic and now my battery's dying we're gonna go and watch a venison masterclass at the um, demo stage it's actually so sweet here there's so many country Cotswolds lovely families here so many dogs I've tried to get some videos of dogs I've tried to touch lots of dogs I've tried to kidnap some dogs predicted my camera died but that's fine came home charged it back in the Ligon hotel and now we are going to Dormy house which is only 10 minutes away from Broadway to have a delicious dinner it looks so tasty and this will be what like the third fourth big meal I've had in the Cotswolds so far it's, it's a bit it's a big weekend go big or go home though right <laughs> We 
staying at Super Bougie Hotel and just realised they have valet parking. I'm leaving this thing here. Could I use all of those amenities when you can? 20 past nine. I've got my Baileys. It's Saturday night and I could not be happier in the Cotswolds. Bit of popcorn. A squashy. And then a bit of makeup removal. And apparently I'm watching darts for some reason. Yes, let's watch X Factor. Yeah. Um, I know I'm young, it's young here. Um, you, I really hope you do well. Thank you. I hope you do well too. Only love can hurt like this. Last day in the Cotswolds. We've just checked out of this as our Tudor hotel, and now we're going to the little Broadway town deli. Go to here. genuinely live in this shop. It is the cutest thing I've ever seen. This is a whole wall of Turkish delight. It's like a cafe, it's two floors. I've got a few bits. Damn, this shop just keeps going. Oh, Christmas shop for biscuits. Meisterklasse. I mean, that's for sure German. I'll have that. Okay, I'll take it. I don't know, is this what you want to see? This is what I want to look back on. My memories of finding French Moutard Royale. Moutard a cognac. Cognac mustard? Little gold seal. Some fancy mustard. Put all the German Christmas cakes in here as well. Look at the little veggies. What's that? Is it like corn? Look at the little carrot. Little pepper, oh they're peppers. Pepper, tomato, carrot, little cream beans, peas in a pod. take their life was misadventured piteous o'er throws do good old grandsire and make known which way thou travelest if along with us we shall be joyful so we've just been to stratford upon avon for a couple of hours and gone to look at shakespeare's house his birthplace there was also shakespeare out loud who did a couple of scenes from different shakespeare plays and then had a little coffee now we're on our way for our final bit of food which is going to be our roast dinner at the bell in all the minster and i can't wait for this sunday roast is my favorite kind of food 